This video is brought to you by Uniparts, showing you how to test this Toyota 5 Series transistor. Uh, the diagram is on this transistor. I don't know if you're able to see that, but there it goes. Um, that would be the diagram for this transistor. Here at Uniparts, we use an analog multimeter, um, which has these two lead connections um, for positive and negative. Easiest way to test this is to apply the red lead to my G, which stands for gate, and then test all the other positions uh, using the black lead, which is common. So applying the red to my gate and the black to my D should get a reading of 10 like that, which is technically like a diode. Um, and then as I apply it to my S, it should be around 10, which is the same thing. Um, these two connections here are actually the same thing. If, I, if you notice, when I touch them, uh, it gives me zero, which means it's direct uh, continuity, because these two are the same. So I apply my red to G then, uh, black to D, should get 10. Should get a reading of 10 when I apply it to my S. And then my second S, or third position, I should get a reading of 10 as well. Now, if I swap them, if I apply my black lead to the ground, I'm sorry, to the gate, and then the red to my D, which is the drain, you notice there's nothing. When I apply it to my S, which is the source, nothing. When I apply it to this third position, there should be nothing as well. Um, between the D and the S, there should be nothing. And then if I swap them, there should be nothing there as well. This is a working transistor. Um, and when, if it behaves in that uh, manner, then it passes the meter test. The next step for this would be to apply it to uh, an actual panel and apply current to it. But if it passes this meter test, we at the very least know that it's working. Um, then we just have to apply, you know, uh, we have to apply uh, amperage to it to see if uh, it can fully take it. I have here a bad one, which I usually keep as an example, where if you notice, uh, no matter what I do, it gives me a reading of close to zero, which is full continuity, which means um, this is shorted. If you notice, I can touch any two leads and it'll, it'll show zero, or close to zero, telling me this is shorted. This red transistor goes in a Toyota 5 series. Um, and usually with these, if one goes bad, you would have to replace all of them. Um, it, if not, usually you're gonna face issues where it'll either blow the other ones or it'll do uh, some other type of damage to your truck. Usually the, the pump card or the, the main CPU would uh, be damaged if, if these aren't replaced properly. Uh, if you have any other questions, uh, you can post it on the link below, um, and we will try to help you as much as we can. Thank you.